Munich to make a new bid for Harry Kane and our chief reporter Carvey Solical has an update for us. What can you tell us, Kirby? Yes, it's an update from our Sky Germany colleague Florian Pluttenberg, who is their top transfer reporter, also follows Bayern Munich and his information just in the last few minutes is that Bayern Munich do want to put in a new bid for Harry Kane and he understands the bid will be 110 million euros including add-ons now that is about 95 million pounds I still think it may not be enough to tempt Spurs to sell Harry Kane but Florian's information is that that bid is going to go in either today or tomorrow now I think we have to be a little bit careful here because on Friday we were told that Bayern Munich were putting in their final bid take it or leave it there was a deadline of midnight on Friday night 100 million euros yeah here we are four days later after that final bid was turned down and we're being told that Bayern Munich are working to put together a new bid for Harry Kane I think if you're a Spurs supporter you'll be looking at this and thinking 95 million pounds it's still not enough but of course first of all we have to wait and see if this Bit actually goes in and then we have to wait and see what Tottenham's reaction will be another quick point to make as well is that Bayern Munich are aware of Harry Kane's feelings about this they are aware that to sign him it has to be now or never because he wants his future sorted out by the end of this week and I'm pretty sure that Bayern Munich will respect that so Florian telling us bye and want to bid and that bid 110 million euros including add-ons should be going in today or tomorrow so if they are running out of time do you think Bayern Munich should have gone higher it's a guarantee if they really want him well I think the other thing you've got to bear in mind is is the structure of all these bids you know we have to be clear Bayern Munich are not putting 95 million Pounds on the table they're probably saying to Spurs you know we'll put this down as a down payment and then we'll pay installments over X amount of years and for Spurs I'm not sure that that's very attractive in the past when they've sold up players of the quality of people like Gareth Bale for instance that was a long drawn out saga ended up with him eventually going out to Real Madrid for I think it was about 80 million pounds they wanted a lot of that up front and we saw it again with Declan Rice's move from West Ham to Arsenal West Ham really held out to make sure that they got the price they wanted and also the structure they wanted so 105 million pounds over two years so those are the kind of things that will be being talked about behind closed doors as well but the deal has to be totally right for Spurs for them to consider selling you know what a lot of people would say uh, is their greatest player ever apart from somebody like Jimmy Greaves you know. They've had a lot of great players but Harry Kane is the, the England captain they need a captain as well don't they yeah they need a captain.